I have a palette today of a kind of items we haven't seen for maybe about a month, maybe a little less. But today, I've got a total of five huge boxes that came on one palette. So, what I got, toys. So, fingers crossed, hopefully there's some collectibles. It's with toys, it's always a gamble. Sometimes they could be just straight, you know, children's toys. Other times it could be toys and collectibles, toys and brand new Lego sets. So, but I didn't really pay very much for these five boxes either. Let me tell you, the full MSRP of all five boxes, everything in the boxes, according to Amazon.com retail prices, $1,502. So that's not bad. $1,500, five boxes, average, you can just average it out. It's like $300 value per box. Not bad, right? But what I paid, all I paid, $170.02. That's it. That includes the actual price, taxes, fees, premiums, everything. I don't pay shipping because I buy locally and I pick up in person. Because shipping costs on these five boxes would have been more than what I paid for all five. Shipping would have been easily a couple hundred bucks in shipping. So, it makes a huge difference when you don't pay shipping costs. But first box. So I love doing toys. I just haven't really had the opportunity to buy very much toys the past several weeks. So this week, I made sure and I tried to get one. And I got one. So, first box. Um, okay, uh, let's start with this thing. Why not? We have the gunned flappy ear um, elephant. Press my feet. Oh, dead battery. Needs new battery, so more. Baby, oh. Let's sing together. Okay, turn that off so I don't get a copyright claim because that song is actually copyrighted. So the doll does work. I just had to <laughs> press the right foot. And yeah, I think I'm selling this thing for like 25, 30 bucks brand new. So it has all the tags attached to it. Good item. So that's like 25, 30 bucks right there. Let's see, is there anything cool in here? Oh, what's this? Spider, ooh, cool. Venom. So here we've got a Spider-Man Venom spin wheel. Uh, his tongue was like flaps around. I think his head's missing now. <laughs> Hold on. I think the top of Venom's head is missing. Yeah, it's missing. So the top of Venom's head, it is not there. So that's going to be a tough sell. So Venom doll, the tongue just kind of goes around. Psh. Without the tongue missing, this is just going to be like literally just a few dollars for that item. If that, we got a brand new factory sealed puzzle, but we've got some Amazon warehouse damaged. So some of the liquidated items will be brand new factory sealed still. But uh, if Amazon, if the workers damage an item, then they liquidate it. But you can tell the inner pieces are still factory sealed, so this is just some box damage to it. But that's still like five bucks the way it sits. Not a bad item. I'm not sure what this is. There's several in there. Harmonics. Dropmix.com. Um, discover pack series one let me scan a barcode see what this thing says I have no idea what this even, even is I don't think I've ever seen this thing before but use the Amazon sellers app see what I can find sometimes it takes a second come on find it okay so on Amazon one pack just one sells for four dollars and seventy cents for like one single pack I guess they're all different one two three there's six in here so like honestly if they sell for four dollars and seventy cents with six of them you're talking that's you know close to thirty dollars but I'd probably sell all these things for like twenty bucks for the entire entire thing more than likely Keep going. 
bounces on water. Here's a pool ball that bounces on water. Looks to be new and packaged. The packaging's warehouse damaged again. I could like five bucks on that. And it's almost like pool season, so that'll move very, very fast. Here is a magnetic super mind makes kids super smart. It says it. If it says it, it has to be true, right? Okay. Looks to all be in there. So let me scan this barcode since it is not covered up by the Amazon LPN label. Kind of curious how much this thing sell for. Much easier to look up values when Amazon doesn't block the label. This thing sells new on Amazon for $24.95. So, like, I would sell it myself for like 20 bucks, you know, give a little bit of a better deal on it. So, okay, it's not bad. Another brand new item. Hot and cold boob therapy gel nursing pads. <laughs> That's actually what it says. Okay. These kind of look used too. They do not look new. They look used, so. Yeah. Not very much. You can't really sell anything used it has to do with, uh, you know, like body parts. It's pretty much impossible. Here we got a VTech. Disney something. Not sure. I'll have to look that thing up, do a little more research on that. I know what that character that just can't place it, but yeah. A little bit of value there. Shape sorting cupcakes. Would you look at that? Factory sealed. Oh, this thing is 100% factory sealed too. This is 100% brand new. So factory sealed. It is learning resources. The barcode is covered up. But I bet you this is a good probably 15, 20 bucks again. Three, four things left in this box. Oh, we have got the gas passer. You cannot get a toys box without either getting out the snot sucker, the mom washer, or the gas passer. But here's the Frida baby, Wendy, the gas passer. What is... If this thing's new, it's like 10 bucks, but we'll just keep it in the packaging. I don't want to find out yet if that's new or used. Oh, here is the bu the bubblegum booster seat. These I was selling for like 25 bucks, uh, open package item or in used condition. Okay, not bad. And then, oh, these are almost impossible to sell. I've got them marked down, I think, for eight bucks right now, and I can't even sell them, but I'm trying to get eight for them. Last thing, first box. We've got Girl Amazing Jeep Wrangler. Remote control car. Yeah, there's the control for the remote control for it. I have to see if that thing works, test it out. That's probably a good 20 bucks right there. So that's box one. Let me box the stuff up. Be back with box number two. Box number two. Box one wasn't too bad. Nothing like big or expensive in it, but we had some decently solid stuff in it though. Oh man. This one's got one piece of paper. And last box didn't have any brown paper, I don't think. I think it did. That one has one piece. What we got? So first thing we got 100 games. Oh, we had something like this number. I was a child except it came in a metal tin, a big metal tin. This does still appear to be factory sealed on all four sides. So, like, I'd probably charge a good 15, 20 bucks for that game. We got Doodle Start. This is not factory sale. It's been retaped by somebody else. Near use makes a huge difference. Oh, factory. Oh no, it's been it's it's been used. So used. I think it's like what 15 bucks or so used. The 3D Doodler. Sage Spoonfuls Happy Foodie. Never seen this contraption before. 
Stainless steel divided plate with blue lid. Oh, so the blue part's just the lid. Five, ten bucks. Oh, we've got a Batman. Justice League Batman. Here's our first kind of collectible kind of item. The packaging on this thing is kind of, it's been opened up. So it's not what you call a collectible condition though. But the figure looks good. Everything looks like it's there. It's just open package item. But we've got a Batman. Cool. That's awesome. Okay. Yeah, if nobody buys that, I'll probably take it out of the package and put it next to the rest of my figures. More than likely. If nobody... Oh. We've got a snot sucker. It is a snot sucker that the packaging on this thing is smushed. And it's been all taped shut. Snot sucker sailing kit. Man. So, first two boxes, I've got the gas passer and the snot sucker. The most disgusting items that you can get in a pallet. Top five most disgusting items. There are more disgusting items. You've seen them on this YouTube channel. Yeah. Snot sucker. This packaging is so beat up in this thing. I, I can't sell that. So, yeah, this watercolor's missing the brush, and it's kind of, yeah, it's that's like a donation stack right there. Ice cream, ice cream cone play set. Listen, Doug's. Looks like it's all there. It's just been opened up before by somebody else. I mean, I'd probably charge like 10, uh, 10 bucks for that or so. It, it'll sell for around 10. <laughs> Waste basket trash can. Might have to keep this and put this on my trash can. I might have to. Easy assembly, official nylon net, transparent backboard. Oh, that's kind of awesome. I seriously might have to keep that. I don't know. I have to decide on that. And we have just a little child's plane nothing like expensive it's the Emirates or Emirates Emirates plane nothing special just a little trinket three things left this box is done complete cleaning <laughs> teach children how to clean the house at early age it's got a broom a mop of Bucket, a dustpan. Wow. That's awesome. Teach your kids how to clean at an early age. Get them to clean the house for you with this little toy uh, cleaning set. Uh, that's probably not too expensive, though. The package on this thing is absolutely destroyed. Like, I'd sell things for like five bucks locally. You can't ship that. It, it, the box is too big. I can't ship that. Door jumper. Man, this package on this thing is also just destroyed. That's gonna be like, like another like a local sale for like honestly probably like five ten bucks. The packaging is so beat up on it, and the size box it would take to ship that out. The expensive to ship. Let's see what is this? Last item box two right here. This says set of two floor lamps with paper shade. This isn't toys. Yeah, it's all in there. Doesn't look to be used. Doesn't appear to be used. But yeah, this is not toys. There's the back of it. It kind of shows what it is. I can't see the camera to see if it's focusing or not, but yeah. I don't know, 15, 20 bucks maybe? I have no clue how much it is. But anyway, that's it for box number two. Box two was kind of eh, eh. Eh, wasn't anything to write home about. It could have been worse though. So, let me box this up. We'll be right back with the third box. Here we go. Number three. Still waiting for that big ticket item to come out. I mean, most of these do have at least one thing that's not always, but usually they have like one thing that's like bigger ticket item. Not always, but usually. Some of these pouts, though, you've seen me open up some pouts. I get like three or four big ticket, like 
100 R plus items. You've seen it. Like sometimes it gets crazy. Or you might have like three or four boxes that are just mediocre, just yeah, it's okay stuff. But then you'll get like a box or two that's just full of just expensive stuff. So hopefully this is one of those. But maybe not this box though. First thing, cozy. Bottle warmer. Still looks new. Just packaging on things kind of beat up. Like that's like 10 bucks in that condition because the packaging's so bad. Oh, here's some baby bottles. This one's missing the lid. So, yeah, this, that'll probably go in like a donation stack. Here's one of those eggs that you open up and you see what's in the egg. This egg has already been opened up, so probably the kid didn't like what was inside of the egg, so they returned it to Amazon. That would just probably honestly just be like a donation. Here's some squishy toys. Bass Squirters. Paw Patrol. It's gonna fight our bag right there. Eh. Another one. Snot Sucker. It's smart. It's Swedish. It's maybe a little strange. It's the doctor invented nasal aspirator that actually works. Actually, my nose tries a little bit stopped up itself. A little bit stuffy nose. Maybe I could use this on myself. Has anybody ever done that on YouTube, I wonder? Like, put the end in their mouth and then like suck out the snot out of their own nose? That'd be kind of funny. Gross, but kind of funny. Because supposedly the filter blocks any snot from going into your mouth, supposedly. I don't believe it, but supposedly it, it blocks the snot. I don't know. I don't know if I believe that. Oh no, one of these LOL eggs. Is this one still factory sealed? This one might still be factory sealed. Hold on a minute. Hold on. And it is. This one is still factory sealed. LOL surprise under wraps. Still sealed. How much do things sell for? New. I have no clue how much these, these sell for. Absolutely zero idea. So this thing sells new for eleven dollars and eighty six cents. It has a rank of one hundred and two. That's one of the. That's a very very good rank. So, uh, things like ten bucks then. Okay, not very expensive. Oh, here we have like a like a barber chair or like a beauty shop chair for like your baby doll. Have no clue what brand it is. Baby doll chair, ten bucks maybe. Well, where's the where's the cool stuff? Paw Patrol costume. Sell that thing here in a few months, about ten. What's this? Ooh, it's, this side has the, some sticky stuff on it. Gross. Gross. Can ugh. Sticky slimy stuff. Pop and sit. Oh, it's just like. Oh, it's a, it's a baby's, like, foldable chair. Pop and sit. Oh, like, attaches to a chair to get, yeah, I see what I'm saying. But yeah, that box is kind of nasty on it. Put it right back into there. Gross. I don't know. Yeah, it's nasty. Here's a thing of blocks. Still factory sealed. No original packaging. I can't think, I've sold this before. I can't think of what brand, oh, hold on. Learning resources. I think this is called like learning resources, gears and something. Something like that, gears. So, still factory seal, just missing the original cardboard box. That's good, like 10 bucks or so. Here's a Munchkin little boat train. Oh, this is for like bath time fun. Still factory sealed. Six in there, what, dollar, like five bucks. A few things left. We have a squirrel? What does it do? Nothing? I don't know how to make it dance or whatever it does. We have a squirrel. Okay. Mini crib sheet set. 
10 bucks. Packaging on is kind of, you know. Oh, there we go. Actually, there's, there's things under this one. We have a Swaddle Me Slumber Buddies Elephant Soothing Sounds and Light. If it works, it's like 10, 15 bucks. It's like an elephant that lights up and makes nice sounds for the baby. Then two things left. A thing of stickers. That's nothing. I think it's, it's Spanish, isn't it? Yeah. So it's Precious Moments Baby. And I think it's like the baby's praying. Oh, 10, 15 bucks or so. Okay, that's it for box number three. Let me box this stuff up. I'll be right back with the fourth box. So I'm still waiting for that big ticket item. Haven't had it yet. But it'll come eventually. Hopefully. Or at least something of some value. This is mostly just, so far it's been like $10 items, $15 items, $5 items. So, I don't know. I'll be back. Number four. We got two left. So, I mean, I've made my money back so far. I mean, I, I know I'm, I'm in profit, but one piece of brown paper. Where's the big ticket items? First thing we got a uh, Enmus Rusty, it says. Oh, nail professional acrylic system. So that's to do with your your nails and toys? Okay. We've got oh wait, like a pink tutu Halloween costume. A good 10 bucks here in a few months when it hits uh, October ish before Halloween. Baby Care Basics. It's kind of cool. You've got a brush, another comb, a nail clipper, and then like a whatchamacallit a thingy. You know what I'm saying? That's probably good, what, six, eight dollars right there. Baby Bottle Cleaning Set. Look at that. With dish drying rack. That's still brand new. That's cool. So Lola Baby, good 10 bucks right there. What we got? Oh, the neck pillow that is a, was a giraffe? Neck pillow? <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's like five bucks. Wow, this thing's a mess. Oh, it's that same uh, cleaning kit. Except everything is out of the packaging on this one. Yeah, this thing's an absolute mess. Yeah, that's gonna be a local sale. I'll do like probably like five bucks on that because the packaging is destroyed on that item. The dinosaur family. What is this? Well, if I get it open. Oh, okay. Bunch of dinosaurs in there. They even have pink, peachy pink dinosaurs, orange dinosaurs, <laughs> purple dinosaurs. <laughs> okay, so a box of like play dinosaurs, a couple bucks of dinosaur, there's probably 10 in there, plus another like small sealed bag of smaller dinosaurs of very colorful colors. Oh, that's probably good. Oh, probably like 15 bucks for the entire box, maybe. That might be something that's kind of hard to sell. You gotta find that certain buyer that's looking for an entire box of pink and purple and orange plastic dinosaurs. That could be half the battle sometimes, is finding that one buyer who wants it. Let's see. Spin and learn color flashlight. Still factory packaged in there. That's about 10 bucks on that item. There's been a lot of baby stuff in here. And the last two things in this box, there's two of them. Two of the Philips Avent bottle warmers. This one's still factory sealed. And this one's been opened. So used, it's like 1015. This one is still factory sealed, has never been taken up. This one's a good like 20. So that's it for the first four boxes. There's one box left. And where's the cool stuff? 
Maybe the last box will have it. Hopefully. Last one. Keep your fingers crossed. Let's hope for no box full of snot suckers. Ooh. This one looks a lot better. I think I see a Lego in there. I think this is the box we were looking for the whole time. Kind of like a good, like a four mediocre and then like one really good one. <clears throat> I think I found it. So first item, we've seen this before on my channel, the Monopoly Fortnite. I think I actually sold it. I think I sold it for 10 bucks the last time I had it. Like, was it last month maybe? I sold it for 10 bucks. So there's another one. Okay. What we got? Oh, we got Spider-Man. Miles Morales Spider-Man. Still brand new. The packaging just kind of came loose on it. But that's kind of cool. That's kind of a collectible toy, kind of. Like, I'd put like five bucks of packaging on it. You know, hurts it. But here we got a board game. Or not board game, puzzle. I sell puzzles for like five bucks all day long. Local prices, that's not shipped prices. Here we go, here's a Lego set. Architecture, Great Wall of China. It is not fire sealed, it's been opened up. So that stinks. For the inner packaging though, Still all factory sealed, there's the instruction booklet. So, okay, so the actual box is opened up, but the actual Lego pieces themselves are all still factory sealed, so that's cool. Just wish it was still factory sealed though, but it's still a brand new set. Like It's still factory on, on the inside, so I'm not sure how much this thing sells for, but I'm gonna find out real quick. So on Amazon, woo, that's expensive. It sells for $49.00. 90 cents brand new on Amazon. So since like this is still brand new, <clears throat> the inner contents are still all factory sealed. Just the tape was cut by somebody. Like since it sells new for 50, like I would knock off like freaking $15. Like I'd sell for like $35 just because the box, the tape was cut and that's the only reason why I'm knocking off $15. So this thing will sell very, very quickly though. That's like 35 bucks in. What is this? Thor Ragnarok. Where's Thor at? Is the package empty? It's been retaped by somebody, but I think most of the contents are missing. I don't think they're in there. Oh, hold on. There's Thor in there, absolutely buried. Okay, here's Thor with the missing hand. I think it's kind of a mess. So whenever, man, this thing is real. Does somebody break this thing? So whenever you see Bandai, you automatically know that's a good quality item. Like it's not cheap. This is a Bandai toy. Where's his hand at? Oh, here's some hands down there. So there are some loose hands, some knives, a couple swords. So his hand is in there. Just got to dig out his hand and put it back on. So let me look this guy up. Let me see how much Thor Ragnarok Thunder Effect set is worth. But this package of this thing is so loose that I don't know how much things actually going to be worth now. But I'll be right. All right, hold on. What if I can get... If put up on my phone, let me let me find out. Wow, this thing's expensive. This might have been my big ticket item or one of my big ticket items. Well, it's probably my big ticket item. It sells new on Amazon for seventy-two dollars and eighty-eight cents. So almost like seventy bucks new. This is obviously not new. It's been opened up. It might be missing some pieces. I'm not even sure. But he's in there. His hand is in there loose. So it might be mostly complete. I am not sure. But myself and Chris Hemsworth, we do look just alike though. That's for sure. I don't know how much thing would, would, would even sell for in that condition. I don't even know if I get 
maybe like half price from like $35, $40, maybe. It all depends on if all the pieces are there. I'm going to have to pull it out and see if it's all there or not. I don't know, but that's a cool item, though. That's like a cool collectible. Like, finally got like a collectible, so. Electric heated gloves. Oh, these have got some value to them. Gloves. Charger for them. Why is this in toys for? It shouldn't be in toys. But heated gloves? That's probably a good, what, 20, 30 bucks right there. Let's see what we got. Speed Racing Drift. So he's got a remote control car. Oh, it's been retaped shut by somebody. But yeah, it's not too expensive though. That brand, I've had this before. It's like 15, 20 bucks. Not very expensive. Let's see. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's just a pacifier. Okay. <sighs> Stay tuned. But just, just. It's the pacifier. I don't know if it's used or new, though. Probably won't sell that because I don't know if it's used or new. But I don't need to that one. We've had the gas passer in, like, box one. We had the snot sucker, I think, in box two or three. Box five, we got the trifecta. We've got the mom washer. So we got the trifecta in these five boxes. You can't beat that. <laughs> these three are the gift that keeps on giving. Gas passer, snot sucker, and the mom washer. Uh, it looks to be new. I hope so. But, yeah, if this thing is new, this is actually a good $10 bill right here for the mom washer. But wait, there's more. Underneath of that one was another snot sucker. But this one actually has filters with it. This package on this one's kind of beat up, so it might be used. I'm not even going to. I'm not even going to find out. That's two snot suckers, one gas passer, and a mom washer. And then one of them I've never seen before. Just a pacifier. So that the pacifier, that one's okay. Let's see. Disney, Melissa, and Doug, Sophia, the first wooden stamp set. Package on's a little bit compromised but good like ten dollars right there so let's see let's end let's end on that one yeah we got two baby bottles gerbers a couple bucks a piece that's like five bucks for both combined oh here's a Lilo and Stitch like a mystery figure in there it's already been opened up so whoever got it didn't like their mystery figure that's Donation stack. Then we've got K2 Adam Kazuza. Some kind of board game. Made by Rebel Board Games. I've never seen this one before. Well, some of these board games, though, they can get kind of expensive. They can. But I'd look that thing up, update below. But last thing, box five. We've got Lego First Responder 513 pieces. It is not federally sealed. It's been opened up and been retaped by somebody. Let's see if the inners are opened or sealed, though. I'm just cutting the retape job. I would never cut the factory seal. Let's see. Here's the pieces. Sealed, sealed, sealed. Instruction booklets. Oh, looks good. Oh, loose tire. Looks like, okay, so all the pieces are sealed, but the tires are loose. Here's all three tires. Those come loose. But then here's all the pieces. That other tire, oh, it's underneath the desk, but all the actual pieces, though, are all factory sealed. So the outer box, once again, was opened up. Let me grab that piece before I forget. Hold on. Okay, so the outer... Box was opened up, but all the actual inner pieces, though, everything is still factory sealed. So, happy about that. I just wish, though, it was still totally factory sealed. Wish it was. But let me see how much this thing sells for, because I am curious. So this thing sells new on Amazon for $39.99. Not a bad price. But since pretty much the only thing wrong with it is 
The outer tape was originally cut by somebody and then retaped, then I cut the retape job. But all the contents are all still factory sealed. So it's still a brand new Lego set. It sells new for 40. Like, it stinks of, I'd have to knock off some value just prices because it's not factory of sealed. So like this is probably like a good like $25 or so. And it kills me to sell it that cheap, but it kills me. But anyway, that's what we got. That's all five boxes. So it it was okay. I got it for like, what, 170 some dollars. I got out two Lego sets. Got out a Thor collectible figure. Got out some Spider-Man stuff. We got out the trifecta of the mom washer, gas passer, and the snot sucker. The trifecta. But we got quite a bit of baby stuff in this one, which that always kind of stinks to get all this baby stuff. But it wasn't bad. It was fun. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. Um, I love doing toys. Sometimes toys can be hit or miss, though. Uh, sometimes I've bought toys in the past that have just been incredible home runs. This one was more of like a single with a stolen base to second. You know what I'm saying? You know, they, they, they stretched it into two. So, yeah, it wasn't bad. I made profit, and it was fun, right? I got some cool stuff out. That's all that matters. So anyway, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, I'm going to have a pal come up on Thursday. I think it's going to be a hodgepodge. Pretty sure. Yeah, I'll, I'll decide. I've got, over there, I've got three pallets of electronics and one hodgepodge. So either I'll do an electronics on Thursday and Saturday, or do a hodgepodge Thursday and the electronics Saturday, but I'll decide. So stay tuned and find out. But the rest of this week, i got videos every single day. I've got mystery boxes. I've got subscription boxes. So stay tuned. Some days, I do upload twice a day. So just because you see a video drop at 6 o'clock, be on the lookout because I might drop again like at 9 or 10 o'clock at night. I've been doing that like three, or maybe three times a week now, dropping two videos a day on non palette days. You know what I'm saying? So anyway... I'll see you very, very soon. Thanks for watching, and I'm out.